Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about Riemann sum tables. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here, the integral from 0 to 19 of f of x dx, and there's a table that corresponds with it. We want to find the right-hand Riemann sum to approximate this integral based off the table below. First thing I want to do is I see my x values right here, and they represent the base parts of each rectangle. And so I want to find the width of each rectangle, the difference between each x value. So the difference between 0 and 4 is a 4. Between 4 and 9 gives me a 5. Between 9 and 10 is a 1. 10 and 12 is a 2, and 12 to 19 is 7. And that's our widths right there for each rectangle. Now again, they told us that this is a right-hand Riemann sum. Right hand. So to find the area of each rectangle, we take its corresponding width, so in the first case we have a 4, and multiply it by the right part of that rectangle, its height. So the height of the right part of the rectangle refers to f of x, and the right part is negative 5. So we have a negative 5 being multiplied here. Plus, Next width is a 5, okay? <clears throat> Multiply that by the right part, its height, negative 4. Plus a width of 1 here, times its height, negative 2. Plus 2, the next width. Multiply its height, negative 1. Plus, lastly, the width of 7, a large one here. Multiply it by its height, just a positive 1. So let's go simplify this out. 4 times negative 5 is a negative 20. 5 times negative 4 is also a negative 20. 1 times negative 2, negative 2. 2 times negative 1, a negative 2 again. And 7 times 1 is a 7. Okay. So now we want to add all of these up. So now remember, each one of these represents the area of each one of our rectangles. Add them all together, and we get the approximate area below. Negative 20 plus negative 20 plus negative 2 plus negative 2 plus 7 is a negative 37. And that's it. Our Riemann sum, our right-hand Riemann sum, to approximate the integral based off the values below of our function is a negative 37. I hope this video was helpful for you. And if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math.